Welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming, where we are the voice inside your head. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Don. I'm IT Explosive One, and we are playing uh, Dr. Decker's Dead, and we're going to find out who killed him. Jay, tonight. Jay looking good. You know, what do you do to relax, TNT Dynamite? Well, I play games. Then do jo it. Jonas, like... Just let's go play games, dude. Let's go down the Choose Your Own Adventure route. But I, I feel like if I say play games, we're a nerd. If we say listen to music, then we're like, I don't know, a, Snob. a yuppie. If I say eating, then we're fat. And if I say we play sport, then like maybe we're like really buff. We're chads. <laughs> yeah, maybe she'll dial date us. But what if she's into fatties, dude? What if she's <laughs> Got a good Maybe point she's there. into chubby boys. <laughs> All right. So uh, you were right. You said something. You said chances are we'll have to pick all of these anyway. Yeah, we probably will. Bottom dude. up. Mariana thought I played hockey. Whatever that's supposed to mean. She's saying you look like a goalie? <laughs> oh, yeah, we do have okay. to pick them. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, cool. <laughs> We relax by doing everything. I bet you like dance music. I don't know why. Mariana told us. Okay, you want to go dancing? Maybe if we pick. I, I like know. playing games. What kind of games do you like? I love video games. Ah. I just wish they'd make ones with stronger female protagonists. Tomb Raider, yo. Sorry, I'd settle for any female protagonists. Very topical. I get it. Come on, Jaya. Tomb Raiders out I here. I mean, there, there's there's some. There's Elo, Alo, Aloy, Alloy, Aloy, uh, B2, 2B. I love food. It will be my downfall. Stress eating is the worst. It really is, Jaya. I'm, I'm glad we had this time yeah. to connect with each other. I'm glad but we I'm... talked. I'm glad we just had to run down everything you could potentially do to relax for her to just make a <laughs> cute little comment so we can go to the next it day. Was, it, was <laughs> it was to learn more about her character. All right. It was character oh, development. Dude, I'm ready for this. All right, we're moving on to the next day. Is this day. another Jaya comes to see us when we sleep? Oh, who's that? Oh, it's Mariana. You said you'd help me with my problem. But he's still here. Oh, we get a dream sequence with Mariana. Dirty bird, huh? <laughs> now she's a flapper, apparently. Who is still here? You are, Doctor. Doctor Decker. He wants me to kill people. Oh. Kill me. Doctor Decker wants you to kill people? He wants them to follow me to the sea. To the creature. Yep. Uh, the creature? <laughs> oh, oh, no. What happens when they we follow you? We know what happens. Yeah, then she's going to straight up tell us now. I'm in for it. It eats them. It's getting stronger. Dr. Decker says when it's strong enough, it's going to walk again. That's why I black out. She knew. Right, well, I don't know if she knew. This is like her subconscious. But uh, this is a Cthulhu thing. Why do you black out? Yeah. He doesn't want me to know. He doesn't want me to remember. So she is the siren. I'm feeding a beast that wants to eat us all. You've got to tell me, Doctor. You have got to tell me the truth. We should. I agree, a hundred percent. What What do you want me to tell you, though? Like, how How do I get this across to you? Yeah. You're dreaming, but your dreams are the truth. That's our power. Don't forget me when you wake. I don't know how I'm in your dream, but now we're together. Let's play a game. Yeah, boy. Let's go. <laughs> I just happen to have my Star Wars edition Monopoly board in the trunk. <laughs> Called hide the... I say a word. You say a word. Ready? I'm ready. Guilty. Pleasure. I, I'm, I'm pissed. Murderer. Pleasurer. <gasps> Claire. That's a good doctor. Now, just give me those three little words and I'll let you go. I love you. 
What? Hold on. Hold on. Oh, it's just, it's I love you backwards. Yes. Yes, you do. She, we are under her spell. You Dude, were right. Dude, that's weird. There's water running down the screen. It's weird, man. Yeah, it is. It's pretty strange. All right. All right. Just making sure there's nothing else we can do. She's, that was neat. She's a scary chick. All right. Yes. Let's go. Next day. He rang my doorbell. The truck driver. The little girl. Killed himself. David is weird. Look, she's watching me. I need to put David. Molly. Out of his misery. Is it okay to steal things? Sleeping tablets. Fingerprints. Dead bodies. I saw Jessica. Should I kill David? Hilda died last night. Do you think I should tell her about psychokinetics? The photos. Dr. Decker seemed to like a drink. Bit of a drinking problem. It's probably the same for Jaya. One of his patients was trying to kill him. He lent me some money. Leaving him messages. Creature. Human flesh. I'd teleported. Do you have that dream, Doctor? Okay. All right. Uh, act five. Uh, Insanity, uh, please. I think this is the final act. Oh. Oh, Doctor. You look... There's something I need to tell you. Oh, God, please. We love you, I too. I can't find Dr. Decker's prescription pad anywhere. I'm not sure when it went missing, but I don't remember seeing it for a while. Yours is there, but I'm scared one of the patients may have got their hands on it. Let me know if you find it anyway, and ask me about Mariana later. I've got news. <laughs> okay. Those oh God. Those prescription pads, man, that's, that's dangerous Who, who's business. Who's all here? One Nathan, of those, is Nathan not here? Prescription Nathan, pad what? I said those prescription pads are kind of important, man. One of those guns missing doctors like, oh, man. Yeah, Somebody's going to start writing prescriptions for everybody. We got Jaya. We got Elin. Oh, Elin wearing a, a Blossom outfit. A again. dress with uh, jeans underneath. <laughs> <laughs> That's the outfit I really Claire wanted to see. And who? And Bryce. No Glenn and no, no Leech Lady. No, we cared Glenn. Glenn's cured. All right, let's dude, let's go straight to Claire, because I want to see David. Okay. I'm I'm game for that. Boom. Let's see what we got here. What does it say? Oh, the prescription crad is missing. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. All right. All right. Claire, baby. Okay, how are you today? Let's get to David. He's supposed to be with us. I'm fine. I killed David. Again. He went too far. He was supposed to come with you. I mean... You trick. She killed him. All right. Well, she... now she goes to jail for sure. <laughs> she was going to go to jail anyway. We should just go straight to... Do you know anything about the prescription pad? <laughs> How did you kill David? Let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How did you kill David? Um, with an axe. Oh. Okay. Oh. I got him to put his head on the wood block. He didn't really know what he was doing. He trusted me. I cut off his head. I like how it isolated your head. When I picked it up, it was smiling. Ew. Probably a muscle spasm. You're mm -hmm. a muscle spasm. The way she's talking about it, you could tell she's repulsed, but it's just like... It's weird, yeah. Yeah, like I'd be in tears. Oh, well, she has a knife now, dude. What's up? All right. How did he go too far? Why does she have a knife? David is a monster. Yeah. I know she got, she's... Hanging up. <gasps> he killed the little girl. Oh, he did it just like she thought. Anushka, why what? is she hanging up, lady? David hunted her and hung her up like an animal. Oh, poor girl. Did, I mean, is she dead, though? David hunted her, huh? Yeah, yeah I want to know if he actually killed her. I guess we got to... Doctor, I think I'm going to be sick. He killed her. Oh, jeez. I can't talk about this. Let's talk about something else, please. Oh, yeah, let's... Nope, like let's keep hosts. right down... Oh yeah, your diagnosis is a jail, mother. You got a chronic prison. It's chronic, running. You got a chronic prison. <laughs> That's sentence. what you got running right now. That's your problem. Uh, Sorry. Yeah. Why do you want to talk about your diagnosis? You promised you'd diagnose me as temporarily insane. 
you can't go back on that now. Yes, we can. We did not tell her that. Before. Oh, temporary has, has changed since you killed your husband twice in less than a month. Oh, I guess we don't get to say anything about that. So let's just tell Akabas. What else Decker can you again. tell me about Decker? Oh, the continuing saga of Dr. Decker. After he'd seen David and done his due diligence, he came up with an offer I couldn't refuse. Remember? The one I told you about when we first met. Sex. I don't think I it was sex. I don't, I'm pretty sure it wasn't. Yeah. That, we could look at what the... Oh, it's the, for the pills. Dr. Decker wanted me to reanimate him. He said he would kill David unless I agreed. Okay. And did you do that? How are you supposed to do that, huh? I mean, we know how, but I just want to know he if she did Valentine's or not. called me on Valentine's night. He promised to use a disposable phone so there would be no trace. I was supposed to come here, where I would find him dead, and then reanimate him. Dr. Decker? I agreed immediately. It seems that Dr. Decker went through with his half of the agreement. But I forgot to turn up. So he killed himself with a paper spike to the heart? I mean, I guess you could jam the paper spike into your own chest. Yeah, but why would he do that? Because he wanted to be a brain-dead heathen. <laughs> no. I mean, that's one idea. I'm thinking that maybe he knew somebody was going to kill him that night. He, uh, he, he already said that he knew that one of his patients yeah. was trying to kill him. It was him. her, dude. I, I don't think so because he asked her to come and reanimate him. So why would says, Why would she come and kill him and then he asked her so to... So she says. She's trustworthy. I mean, that's fact. I still think... It's a little off. All right. Yeah, I feel you. Let's do, see what happens with Do you know anything pad. about uh, the prescription pad? <clears throat> I never saw Dr. Decker's prescription pad. I imagine he kept it hidden away. In a locked box is where Stop he should. Stop people stealing it. Keep it. For safety reasons. I agree. And I guess, uh, you know, we find out about the death threats on the next one. All right, death threats on the next yeah, one. Yeah, that's all the time we have for this episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe. If you already did that, there is a notification bell. You can hit it. Does stuff for Jonas. TNT. Oh, we out.